we need to remember in this matter is the lives of the persons who lost their lives. And I have been deliberate in mentioning their names continuously. I have also been deliberate in not mentioning the name of the accused man because it is my eternal hope that we will forget his name although it seems as if it seems as if there has been um, quite a lot of um, his name has been wide and abroad in the same way that with other persons who have committed similar offense, Mr. Perry in particular, they become a footnote and they are only remembered when we look for legal precedents. I would hope that we remember these persons, Ms. Wright in particular, from the victim impact statement and other things, was significant as a woman, a young woman, who was looking after her four children and also studying and finding time to run a shop at the time. These three children, Commanda, Charlie, and Rafaela, would have been in school and had their own hopes and dreams. The information from their, their father indicate that the possibility was being looked into for them joining him overseas in other places. And Kishan Henry, uh, his family would not have the opportunity of hearing him, of seeing him go to school as a child at that particular age. I think it's important also to remember, in particular for Miss Wright, that she was somebody who, with all the difficulties that she had, was still able to be generous enough to try to help somebody who was in need. And I think that it's important for us to celebrate that generosity. And it was not her fault. It was others who were responsible for what they did. So, Mr. Barnett, the order of this court is that you will be sentenced to life in prison. There are five sentences, five con con concurrent sentences, and that you will serve 62 years, I'm sorry, 61 years and four months and eight months before you are eligible for parole. Thank you very much, sir. You can have a seat. That would appear to be the list for today, Bilal. Very well. Unless your lordship had set the part heard <laughs> trial case for this afternoon. Uh, no, madam, I was not able. I was not able to be successful in terms of finding another trial case for this afternoon. Um, I will ensure that I don't make that uh, mistake again. Very well, madam. Well, adjourn from the please. Stand, please. This honourable court stands adjourned until ten a.m. tomorrow. God save the king. In that minute.